Welcome back everybody to Galactic Science 2. Right, where are we at since last time? Well, I dug out the, uh, the compound a little bit and hello. It's not an episode where the cat does not uh, cause some sort of interruption whatsoever. Yeah, you're going to stay right there, aren't you? Yes. All right, so done that. We've actually, I've moved the uh, photogenic uh, isolator over to a point where I can actually just hook it straight up to my applied energistics uh, network for the fluid to, that's why we had the, uh, where is it? The fluid export bus. I believe that's why we were given it for that one said very reason. Right, so where are we at quest wise? Now, I did take the liberty and go ahead and complete the quest for retinol. That's for the carrots. So they were actually something we could do, well, could have done. So went ahead, did that uh, off camera. Did also the quest for the glass, which was just mainly uh, using the silicon from the uh, obsidian. So I'm thinking we could probably set something up uh, like a cop, like pretty much like a. Uh, I'm not sure if it's an infinite cobble gen loop, where you can just take your uh, obsidian. So one piece of obsidian. Actually, I'm not sure if, it, if there is actually a a gain when it comes to the amount of cobblestone one can get. Now, cobblestone, if I remember, oh no, I have to break, you have to break the silicon dioxide down even further. So, try and get about 16 or so, because that's how many we had. Plugging that back into, so it's silicon, silicon, Oxygen, same sort of ratio. So one piece of cobblestone. Uh, this is uh, eight, eight sixteens. Eh. You do end up with more cobblestone than you uh, started out with with one particular pe one one piece of obsidian. So the sort of um, balancing of that. Not sure, but I'm, I'm going to work on that and try it out. So I've got cobblestone cobblestone for days right now. Well. More so, rather than uh, maybe even going ahead and using going through the quest book and actually doing other parts of it, namely, I think it's improvements. Maybe here we are. That's faster machines. Stars align. No, I don't think it's in that quest either. Elements. So, Ignatius extruder. Eh. We'll, we'll try. We'll try and go through it anyway. But for that particular quest, we need one of these good things, the machine frames. And we're, it's really, really, really slow. Okay, so we're, we're not getting, getting very far with that. I need to set up a quarry. Quite chronically and quite quickly. And we're going to have to find some way to set up a decent sort of uh, product, assembly line, production line, processing line one of those to get everything started so that's what we're going to do today is we're going to build a quarry just so we can get ourselves off the ground uh, Q U A double R Y there we are quarries All right I don't know where the quest for the quarries went but um I'm, I'm sure there was one. Uh, moon trance. Yeah, I'm, I'm fairly sure there was one. I'm not sure, even sure whether, whether it was in improvements or... Yeah. But we definitely got to get one. Absolutely. Um, hmm... Yeah, I don't know. 
So I have to go get, just uh, go take the uh, good old uh, the hammer, go out and do some digging, and get the quarry all set up. Oh well. Um, there's that. Yeah, the quest book seems to be awfully trimmed. I don't know why. But, okay, let's go ahead and just see where the quest book takes us. Uh, okay, so one iron oxide and one copper. Copper is easy enough to get because I think I've actually, yep, I've done a copper nugget to get some copper ingots. And uh, we're just going to chuck them straight through the decomposer. Like such. It's always nice to have redstone. And the iron, we've actually got there, so we can chuck that through. And we'll take the oxygen that we've got from uh, a few other little decomposings that I've done in... I wouldn't say in the past, but in the last few days. Right, so we'll clear that out. Uh, the iron, that's two, one, two, three. So I'll just make all that. Detect, claim our block of redstone. Yeah, now it's starting to lead us into the extra lasers. Right, um, Okay, they want three carbon nanotubes. The easiest way to get the carbon nanotubes is actually take one of your diamonds from your CFD and just slap it through there. Detect, claim, done. Ah. This is where the quarry was hiding. <laughs> right. So, the lasers. Lasers, uh, the one block of redstone is that we've got for the quest rewards, probably not enough. Although it is going to help. But we're just going to need a lot more uh, obsidian because the thing is, only, yeah, it's one obsidian block. Actually, two obsidian blocks per laser. Is it only one laser the quest is actually? Uh, no, you need three. So I'm going to need at least six pieces of obsidian. Okay, so throw that in there. The nanotubes that we were just given. One, two, three. Uh, no. Ha! Interesting. Yeah, we're going to go through the assembly table. Yep. Hmm. Well, bugger. So that's only going to give me two lasers. I'm going to have to do some digging. Unfortunately, friends. So uh, we'll be right back after I've uh, put a hole in the ground and extended out the, uh, the hole around the base. So we'll be right back. All right, well, the little guy's been hard at work, so we should have enough for the three lasers that we require for the, uh, the actual quest themselves. So... Um, oh... Let's put them in there. So, yeah, now we've got the amount of lasers that we should have. Uh, oh, that's right. The quest, <laughs> they, they, don't, uh, they don't work as well as they should. Right, cool. So now we've got five lasers. Absolutely fantastic. I'm not going to be making any more lasers than this. Because by the stage I'm able to, I'm going to be looking at the, uh, the other lasers. So that should okay that's going to give me 240 rf per tick and it's probably going to be uh, about five or so minutes when we can uh, finally get a machine frame so that there's that that's that we can't do much with it 
Right. Uh, the other thing we could do is not a hell of a lot because, the, yeah, the machine frame is going to take time. Not much we can do there. Uh, I think with the, uh, this one, oh, the, oh, yay. Actually, that's, that's really, really nice. Actually, having been given extra landmarks to start off with and three marker pluses, which are going to be handy later on because I never got that far. So that's going to be cool. Absolutely. So we're kind of stuck waiting for things to happen. The other thing I would really like is to have the ability to make sawdust. Because I would really, really love... That's pulverizing. Actually, a pulverizer. How hard is a pulverizer? How hard is a pulverizer? Oh, we need a machine frame. <laughs> well, actually, there's something we could do. Yeah. All right, so here's my thinking. I was actually going, instead of using, uh, not item ducks. No, well, item ducks is what I was thinking, actually thinking of using. But instead of using transfer nodes, I was going to use item ducks instead. Because I reckon they, they could be a lot better. So, to work, how am I going to work this? Cobblestone going into the barrel. Now, we can definitely pull liquid, actually liquid ducks. Yeah, um, duct. Okay, so that's a fluid. Lux duct, no, no, no. Item, no, I want fluid. Uh, item ducts, fluid ducts. Hardened fluid duct. Hardened lithium glass. Uh, this is the induction smelter. I don't think we can actually make the induction smelter, to be honest. Hard aluminum glass. Ah, we might not be able to... Actually, that's the glass. Uh, how about the opaque ones? We can make opaque fluid ducts. I think. Yeah, lead. Lead and invar. Invar, we can actually knock together right now. Because uh, nickel, uh, right, we'll just shove that in there. I think I've already done some. We'll take the iron, the nickel, 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 okay, uh, iron, copper, copper, copper. I could have swore I had some nickel somewhere. Or I could be sadly mistaken. Oh, I've got ferrous ingots. Right, so we're going to decompose those. That'll give us the nickel that I was after. So a stack of that. Now, the Invar. I know we can make this. Inva ingot, tech reborn. Six nickel, ten iron. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six nickel. Nine, ten. Cool. So then, uh, lead. We've got the stack of that, so... I really should uh, look at maybe either some more furnaces because this is actually going to take a little bit of time. All I want is enough uh, nuggets to get me one, one ingot. And from that, 
Yeah, it's, it's been ages since I've actually played with uh, thermal dynamics uh, pipes, so it's going to be fun. So we're just waiting. Uh, okay, so we've got three. That's three. Just waiting for another three. We can make an ingot. And then after that, I think we need to make uh, pneumatic servos. So that's one. That's one. Cool. Nine. Fantastic. So we've got a lead ingot. Invar. Hardened fluid ducts. Uh, my trusty pickaxe. So we're just going to pop this off. They they will connect like such. <clears throat> Excuse me. Right. Let's configure that to not pull at all. Now the pneumatic servo. Redstone, iron, and glass. Uh, iron. Okay, we uh, don't want to be pulling the glass from there. No siree. Hmm. Uh, iron. <laughs> we've got a, we've got a lot of it. We just got to process this stuff. That's all. But we're not quite there yet. So all this is just early, early game stuff until we can actually really get into actually casting the ingots. Not quite yet, but uh, yeah. Let's go grab some, uh, some silicon from the obsidian. Right. So I can knock some glass together. Clear those out. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. It gives me two pieces of glass. Really? Well, we only needed two, so that, that's not not that's not too bad. Um. Damn it. It does indeed take four four pieces of iron. Have I lost all? No, nah, I shouldn't have lost all that uh, progress. Shouldn't have. So let's just stop that. And make some more nuggets together. And while that's happening... We'll connect up the rest of these tanks. Right. Now, got the redstone. We're just we're just waiting on iron. That's ten, so that's one piece. Twelve. Hmm. Okay, that was odd that I had to re actually refresh the um, re machine frame to actually keep that going. 14, 17, or oh, one more piece. There we go. 18. Great. This is just almost... A dis I'm only doing, doing this to actually prove that I can actually do it, that it will work. Right, so clear that. So pneumatic servo. Uh oh. Eek. Um, well, luckily I have some oxygen on me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to make sure to uh, replenish that. So uh, shift. Hmm. Okay, that's unusual. Yeah, I thought...
No. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Uh, Reinfor extracts items. Oh. Whoops. Okay. So let's internal redstone control fluids. So we've got hardened pipes, don't we? Yeah, we do. So hardened pipes, uh, invo ingot. Uh, okay. Well, the servo we we can use at a, a, at a later date for something else. Um, oh, I've got the invo ingots too. Uh, let me see. Hardened servo. What was I missing? Got the ingot. Oh, just. Oh, glass. More glass. Okay. I was uh, like operating under the assumption. Uh, I think. When was the last time I really played around with thermodynamics? It could have been 1.64, I think. A very long time ago. So that's one piece of glass. Right. There's our nuggets. Cool. So then we use these on there. You right click that. Uh, oh man, that's so cool. Um, and then let's just check this out because the if in the first series and I, I just use transfer notes completely and utterly I think this might be a better way to go for transporting items and liquids and, and such and everything so at thermal so oh stack size so reinforced you can go up like like pulling stacks at one like a stack a second a stack every half a second. Uh, I don't think you need to go to resonance. Signalium, like speed bonus times two times three. Extract from multiple slots. Ooh. 200, 150%, 100%. Wow. <laughs> so, while it's not. Uh, say the the sort of speed that you get from something like uh, applied energistics, it may be a darn sight quicker than item nodes. Because I'm definitely gonna, I'm thinking about using these for the um, the decomposer synthesizer setups that we go through. Yeah, gonna give it a go. Well, anyway, and also, I'm going to make up some item ducks. I'm going to set these along the top. And uh, get this, uh, th this, get this uh, thing happening. Yeah, we could set up a, like a cobble gen right now. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, folks. Well, uh, if you like the episode and like the series thus far, do go ahead and click that like button. And of course, if you're interested in anything else I've done in the past, check out some of the playlists over to the right-hand side over there. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. I've been Raytech. I'll see you next time.